Uh, what's up guys, welcome to Daniel Fuse. Today I'm going to talk about the fuse indicator. But first of all, uh, let's see, let's talk about the fuse himself. Uh, we use uh, fuse to to protect the wiring of uh, electrical equipment. And and we, we, we usually find numbers on the fuse. And these numbers, they are the one that tell us how much current is allowed to pass through here. Of, um, tell us the limit of the current that's allowed to pass through the fuse. For example, this uh, is 1025. 25. That means the the maximum current uh, is up to 25. More than that is gonna uh, burn up the fuse. When the fuse is burned up, there's a small wire between these two here. And this fuse here gets burned or cut off. That's, uh, that's pro protecting the current going through the, the uh, to our load. So the current uh, flows through this small wire here all the way to, to, the, to the rest of the circuit. So um, usually this is how it's working. We always have like, power and uh, our load. We have a uh, positive terminal and negative a negative wire is always connected to the load right and then for the positive the the positive uh, terminal wire and the ne and the and the positive terminal wire from the ro from the uh, load is break down with the fuse like so so that means our current flow from the power all the way through the the fuse to our load like so so uh, the 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 current allowed to flow here is determined with the the fuse here for example this is, is it in uh, 25 25 ohms that means the current that uh, flows here it should be under 25 ohms to go to the to the load if it is more than 25 this small wire here is gonna break down or melt down and they're gonna cut the uh, the continuity of the of the fuse so that means the 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 power it won't go through it won't go through the fuse to the load but it's gonna go through and gonna stop here so that means uh, your load is, is being protected from the overload current so I'm gonna show you a fuse indicator how you can uh, implement the indicating LD to our, our circuits for example here so we're gonna have our power okay this is our power here like so and then I'm gonna uh, hook up a motor here presenting uh, our presenting load negative negative goes to the negative directly like so So, we, what we have just done is this part here. We got the power, we connected the negative to the load, and then here we, we left a space here for the fuse, so this one here. If I connect this to, these two here, uh, the power is going to flow all the way to the motor and go on. So, if I do like so, here the motor is turning, so the power is going, is going through it. So if we use a fuse here, like this one here, I put between this the space here, the motor is turning as you can see. Uh, let me put this one here. See it's turning. So that means the, the current is flowing through the fuse all the way to the overload. So if if uh, the fuse is broke if this small uh, wire here is burned up, there won't be current going through the fuse. Like so, uh, this uh, uh, is not working. It's, uh, it's not working. It's broke fuse. So you can see that it's not working. So I just want to show you a simple LD indicating uh, for this kind of problems. I'm gonna hook up an LD uh, parallel with the with the fuse. 
Okay, that looks good. Have to put the right way. And, and with the LD, we have uh, the shorter the, sh the shorter side is a negative, and the long is a positive. So we have to put the right way. Okay. You can see uh, our LD is lighting. So here, I just add transistor here, like so. So the power goes here, limited with a 1K resistor, limit the current here, enough to power an uh, LD, and all the world. So that's what's happening here. So I haven't connected anything, the load is, is not is not turning, there's no current going through the load. So that that's mean, this indicates uh, that the fuse is broke, when it's broken, when uh, when the, the small uh, wire there is, is cut off, of a uh, meltdown there's no there's no connection here there's no continuity so like this one is uh is broke if i connect here there's nothing happening because the the, the current is not flowing through the fuse there's nothing inside here and i already continue lighting but look if i put the the, the working fuse the ld stop and the low and the power goes through the the fuse, the power goes through the fuse to our load, and our load, the current starts going through. So, yeah, uh, like this is as simple as this. This is like connecting a wire here between these two terminals. See, like so. This, uh, this tape so you can see uh, the sliding. So this, you see, this means if there's a continuity between the uh, be between the fuse, the LED doesn't light, indicating the the uh, the fuse will be okay. If I remove the continuity, the LED normally should should light. Uh, my blackboard is, is not really good. Okay, so the uh, fuse, our, our LED light. If our fuse is, is burn up, it's gonna indicate the LED by lighting. But if it's a con is if our LED is working, it to stop, to stop uh, lighting. So that's how it's working. <laughs> 